Hello, you fellow engineers, and welcome back to Portal 3. Yes, I know it says Revolution there, but the third Matrix film was called Matrix Revolutions, so therefore I'm allowed to call this Portal 3, right? Right? It's not clickbait, don't cancel me! Anyway, we continue at the surface where we've escaped the... Oh, I say escaped the test chambers. We found out the, the facility's completely destroyed and the test chambers, because they're like way... They're way stronger, so you, usually you can't escape. Uh, they're the only way we're going to be able to get through this, this testing area. Uh, so, what we got here? We got a button which opens the exit over that way. There's an orange portal there. I can't move those yet. I can only shoot the blue ones. Uh, looks like I gotta find a cube to go on there. Now we're looking around up there. That is a cube dispenser. Uh, I've just got to try and find out where a button is for it. So if I've got my portal over there, let's just go have a look. Yeah, looking down. I don't see anything actually. Let's just head back. Oh my god. Ah, ah. <laughs> I forget about portals being vertical and it being weird. Anyway, so... Maybe if I look up. Aha! Zoom into the middle of my mouse. There is a button. Oh, and what's what's that through this portal? It's today's video sponsor. This video is sponsored by Three Cubes, whose Kickstarter is now live. Three Cubes is on a mission to create the most relevant place for creativity and learning. It's an online sandbox platform with more simulations behind voxels, enabling you to explore dynamic worlds, build contraptions, and play with technologies. Also, get ready for co-op adventures with rewards, public spaces, custom games, and tools for UGC. Your journey is tracked on your web portfolio and it's all free to play. Support them now and get some incredible Kickstarter exclusive in-game rewards. Click the link in my description. Right, well anyway, yeah, we're there. Let's get back to the level. So we've got to go up that way and then as we drop down yeah we've got to get over there okay so i reckon then if we go if we go up that way so we're now we're now up here on this balcony so if i shove that up there and then huh, jump down i should go flying over to the button boosh so I press that a cube should drop down nice and then to get over that side i think i've just got to do a jump like we down like that oh my goodness all right so now we've got a cube i've got to get back over that way so let's shoot a portal down there which by the way that looks like if i put that up the top that is a very very strong wall layout anyway we'll drop down here we'll go through the left nut so that we're out here we can then shove that on the button and then presumably if i if i shoot back up there so i'm on the the balcony again i can probably shoot a portal over that way and then as i drop down we we fly to the exit nice so now we are on oh, testing chamber nice. two right so the robot that's like guiding us around in this game which i'm not gonna like hate the voice of it is no Stephen merchant so i will just paraphrase basically they they describe like how the place got in such disrepair um, and essentially they just describe like the the first portal game there was a little human like me who destroyed oh what's she called was she called like mother or something i don't know the the core the robot that was in charge so yeah basically uh our human character destroyed everything right anyway where we got to get to there's an exit over that way can't seem to shoot anything over there i don't even know like where a normal portal is what does that say jump off an edge to get momentum yeah okay okay but there's no there's nothing to shoot down there game oh look above me there's the there's the blue portal okay so if i shoot on the floor here then i'm up I'm up on this balcony with that one. Oh, look, that's angled. Oh, I wonder, could I, like, make the jump over to that one? Annoyingly, there's no sprint button in this, but I am going to try. Oh, no chance. No chance. Hmm, I can shoot on the ceiling. Does that actually help me? Oh, yeah, could I? Right, hang on. I'm having a thought. I'm having a thought. So if I, if I shoot a portal up there, then this one, I'm looking straight down. So I'm looking from there straight down. I mean, can you? You can't see me. You can't see me. So I'm thinking if I, if I fall through this, I'll be falling down there. I can then shoot down that way, which means I go back in, well, back into this one, meaning I come out the orange. That's how I get across, isn't it? So we shoot up there. We look straight down then as we fall we shoot the other portal and then we fly through oh that was cool that was cool anyway we've now completed this we're on to stage three so we have portal on the floor we've got to get got to get up there i'm guessing so we've got We've got a ceiling there. We've got that on the wonk. So probably similar thing, but I've got to end up coming out of there probably. Okay, so if I look down, yes, we do We do have a thing there. Okay, so shoot that up. Then as we fall down, we're going to shoot straight down. So we come back out of this. Then, yeah, then if I shoot on there while I'm like midair, as I drop back through this portal, I should fly over. Okay, I think that makes sense. So shoot up there, then look straight down and then shoot. And then we just got to find... Boosh, that one, and then we fall through, and then, oh my goodness, 
<laughs> Hopefully that made sense. Okay, I'll think about it. I am quite good at this. I like doing jobs that I'm good at, even though somehow my job is being a YouTuber. But anyway. I'd rather say this before it's too late. Use the gels sparingly. Gels? The gels are also highly corrosive and will eat through metal and skin given enough time. Might be good to know. Oh, great. So we're getting gels and they sound quite dangerous. All right. Okay. So the exit is up there. Looks like we've got a button behind the glass that we've got to go press. So I can go get that. Got to put a cube on it. Where do we get a cube? Oh, look up there. You can get a cube. Oh, there's a portal down there as well. So there's a button over that way to get the cube. How do I get up there exactly? Let's go have a little wander. So we've got Oh, what's through there? There's a little thing through there as well. All right, so there's a wonky platform there, which is probably going to send me up to that area. I think that's where I get the cube. So the question is, what do I do first? So, <laughs> so I can jump down there to fly out of this way. Ah, oh, look, there's that up there. Okay, so shoot up that way. Then as we drop down, we can get over to here, which is where the exit is. I can also, well, I can see quite a lot from up here. I reckon I probably need that one on there. The thing is... Oh, I can't get to the orange one very easily. So what I've learned, I've got to try and... I've got to get to a point where I'm falling through the air and then probably shoot that midair, maybe. I mean, or I could just see what happens if... Like, maybe maybe just jumping down this will be enough momentum. Because there is still quite a drop. So if you go, we... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, that was enough. That was enough. All right, so this... Oh, we got fluid. So this is the gel. Oh, so it's gel that comes out of there. Oh, and then that's going to shoot out of this portal and land on here. Okay, so if I press that, you can see... Oh, my goodness. It's... Blah. It's blobby. What does that do? Oh, it's bouncy. Oh, it's really bouncy. Ah, help me. <laughs> help me. Okay, so I think then if I try and get back to where I was. So I'm back up here with that portal on there. So I reckon as I fly through this time, I should probably bounce and then go straight through, right? So if we just drop through here, we'll land on the blue and then boing, bounce over to this way. Yes. And this is where a cube will whack me on the back of the head. So now I've just got to take this back. So presumably just drop down come through here and then where am i getting this again oh just over to that way question i know this is probably wrong but can i just lob it ready oh that was close that was actually close <laughs> okay so doing this legit again i reckon we go through here now we're down the bottom so now if i shoot my blue portal up there that's how i get back up so i do that with my cube so i come out like that and then i can just go bonk shove that there and then uh, i mean maybe maybe i can just uh, drop it and oh i didn't land on the button fine i'll come help myself out so cube on the button which means the exit is completed which means if i head back to get to the exit it was just shoot up there and then fall down here nice we're back with the gels gotta admit watching you fly through the air like that looks pretty fun Sometimes I wish I could do the same. Telling me, I had a great time. Right, back in the lift. These tests were never designed to be exposed to the surface. We've not come across any toxic plants yet, but stay alert. Okay, so basically there might be toxic plants. There might be other things that sort of affect stuff. Does this make me bouncy? No, I am. I can't see anything. I'm all like blue. But anyway, we have, we have the blue bouncy liquid here. We've got... Got a bit of a drain there, a bit of a waterfall. Interesting. All right, so that is ticked. Presumably that means the the yellow portal, does it? So if I press that button, oh, it does that. Okay, so if I get off that, that stops. Got it. So presumably, if I go into the portal, I will go up to there. Do I want to go up to there? What is that? It looks sort of dangerous. Oh, speaking of dangerous, we've also got a line of turrets over that way. Not ideal. Although, look, can you see that? I'm wondering. If I put a portal there... Oh, I can't put a portal there. Okay, never mind. Never mind. <laughs> right, anyway, what does this button do then? It's another waterfall in there. Oh, okay, so that's what that's what this button does. It just swaps where the waterfalls are. I imagine the waterfall will wash whatever that is, like the blue stuff. Um, over this way, we've got danger. Yep, they will try and shoot you. There's also, there's also poo water that we don't want to fall in as well. So, question is, what do we do? Oh, look, there's a platform up there. So, if I go through this orange portal, I... Oh, I fell down. I want to try and end up literally on that balcony. So where's the bottom? Okay, there's the bottom. Easy does it. There we go. There we go. All right, we're on the balcony. So, I can now drop down into there. The question is, where do I want to get to? I'm thinking if I shoot over there, I can jump over the turrets. So, huh. 
Ow. Oh, no. Oh, no. It was a dead... It was a, it was a dead end. So, yeah, there's a barrier there. <laughs> Maybe I should have done, like, that one, perhaps, to fly over that way. Oh, that's where the exit is. Good to know. If I just get back to this point, let's try shooting there instead, then. So, now I fly through... Oh, my goodness. Ow, 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 ow. Okay. <laughs> So perhaps that's not the way to do this. Right. What if then, rather than me moving around, because what I'm thinking, this blue stuff, if I shoot like that way, then yeah, 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 yeah. When I press this button, oh, look, we're bringing the blue, except we're not because it's being washed. So if I do that, it will start getting washed there. So it can't get any further. But then if I swap it back, so the, the waterfall comes on there, that one stops. Some blue should make it through, right? So if I do that... You can see that's continuing. That's now going up there. So does that mean it's now it's now stored up there? So if I were to, for example, shoot oh yeah, there, then I can make this platform bouncy. So if I do that and then I step off this button, does the blue stuff drop? Oh no, it doesn't. Okay, so I think then I've just got to do exactly what I did, but I step off the button when the blue gets to like close to the top. So the blue is there, I think. Do that, step off, and then the blue. Yes, it's splurted all over that table thing, which means, I think, now I can go up here. And then from here, if I jump down and fly through that, rather than being shot to death, I should just bounce straight past them and they won't be able to shoot me. Let's see if that is the case. Boing. Ow, ow, oh, they still shot me. <laughs> they they still shot me. Okay, I'm wondering, maybe if I did the same but there, the bouncy stuff, it might actually go through that grating. Because I couldn't fit through the grating. I'm no Terminator. But maybe the liquid will. And that will send them flying. Let's see if that's how this works. So we set this up to get some of the liquid again. And then when it gets to near the top. We shoot up there. And then step off. And then yes there it goes. Oh and there's all the turrets go flying. <laughs> I hope this glass is bulletproof. Oh they're literally bouncing like everywhere. <laughs> Look at them go. Okay nice. So I think I'm now safe to do the jump. So I can, we bounce over here to the exit. We've made it. We're on level six. So what have we got? We got button in front of us. Congratulations on completing this test. All right, then we get interrupted by annoying non-Steven Merchant man. Right, so button there. Let's just see what that does first. Oh, it's an elevator to do that. Okay, that's good to know. We've got, oh, a square button. I don't know what a square button does. I cannot press it though. Presumably, odd. Oh, that's the imprint of a cube, isn't it? So we've got to get a cube onto that. And we can head through here. We've got orange liquid this time rather than blue. Orange. Oh, yeah. Orange is the run fast one. So we. So that's pretty cool. Ah, I'm all more orange in the eyes. So we've got a cube here. I, I assume if I want a new one, I press that. That gets rid of the old one. New one appears there. So we may need that at some point. But anyway, let's run through here. We get washed off by the waterfall. That's important to remember. But shove that on there. That opens a portal. Oh, I can shoot down there. And then everything down here is getting all orangey. I don't know if I meant to do that or not. But uh, that's good to know, I guess. Anyway, how can I get a cube onto that button? What's the point of the orange? Is there anywhere in here to shoot? No, but I can get a new cube which will turn that portal off, right? So if I do that, we get our new cube, but we have no portal there. I can, of course, shove that on that one, but that's not really going to allow me to get up here. Now, is there anywhere up here where I can I can shoot my liquid? That's... <laughs> <laughs> what did he say? No, I don't really I don't really see anywhere. I'm just looking at this. This is like a bit of a, a bit of a ramp. I assume this cube isn't gonna slide down there, is it? I punt it. No, it's not. If it was orange, maybe it would. I don't think there's anywhere to shoot though. No surfaces. Anyway, let's put that back on there for now. And then oh I wonder, I wonder actually, if I pick this up, this is all orange now. Will this slide now? Because it's all like, oh, it's all covered in the goop. Yes, oh, it's sliding. Quick, quick, quick. Get on here. Get on here. Okay, so it slid onto the button. Oh, it fell off the button. <laughs> it was too slidey for its own good. All right, so this is like curling. I've really got to really got to channel my inner Winter Olympics here. So line it up perfectly. Pretend there's two people brushing it. And then watch, watch, watch. Yes, yes. Okay, we're up. We are up. All right, so now we're up here. Probably shouldn't stand on the crack. So there's the splooge coming out. I, I imagine, yeah, I can just go straight to the exit. Decent. Oh, goodness. Oh, dear. <laughs> Ooh, looks like that door's broken. Maybe I can reroute you. No, root. We've been see. through this. It's reroute, not route. Ha <laughs> ha, look at that. Okay, so we've got we've got a diversion. Right, okay. What we got here then? We got a button. What does a button do? Oh, it went that way. Oh, it went round. 
Oh, it turns it turns that waterfall off. That is a big waterfall. Okay. Oh, there's a portal behind me. I don't know where the where the orange portal is, but yeah, as soon as I go through this, that portal will be deleted. So fair enough. All right down there, we've got poo. So don't go down there. Around here. Oh man, this level's like really outside. Oh my goodness, look how tall it is. So there's a button up there for a cube to drop out. But oh. There is, there's an orange portal somewhere. Let's just jump through it, see where it is. Oh, I was literally, I was literally right next to it. Okay, so the orange portal is here. So I can shoot up there to go get a cube, I guess. Yeah, using this button. So as I do that, oh, it's not a cube. It's splooge. Okay, so if I shoot down there, then it flies up there and then comes back through, which means if I then shoot there, it will fly over that way. But yeah, then we have we have the waterfall in the way. So that's why we need to turn the waterfall off. Got it. I should probably leave that going for now. So if I get off this button, we've still got yeah, we've still got orange splooge. So let's go see where would we need that. I mean, worth noting the the splooge is sort of just like settling like in the portal. It's not it's not flying anymore. So wherever I put it, it's not going to go very far. So I can get back up here on the button, get a bit of momentum going, then shoot down that way. Oh yeah, that's making a mess. I think that's all we've got to do here. Try and make a mess because then I can sprint up that way, which will probably be useful. Maybe I do the same up here. Ah, oh, because now can I like sprint and get a bit of air? Oh, I can. That could be useful. Would it be worth doing it down there as well? I don't really know what's down there. Hmm, let's drop down and see what actually is down here. Anything good? Now nah, I'm not... I'm not really sure. There are some there are some things there. Can you turn those on for me? Guess not. All right, so if I want to get back through that waterfall, I think I've got to fly through that, which means I need momentum. So if I do that and then sprint straight ahead, then I should come flying up. I can then shoot my portal there. Then as I... Oh, I hit the edge. Take two. As I fall back down down i then fly through the waterfall nice from here look we have a cube so press that wonky button oh my goodness that did not sound good but we have cube now and i can probably go put this on on that button right although the game wants me to put it on that button to turn off the waterfall the trouble is i don't know how to get over there because if i go through that thing the the cube will disappear oh i'll tell you what though the cube might disappear but if i hang on if i shove that down here next to this portal then i'm pretty sure i can still go through this wall and then shoot on this wall here and then my orange portal is still here we've got the cube Yes, we've got through the barrier, so I can shove that on there, which means waterfall has finished. And with no waterfall on the go, it means once we've got the liquid flying in the air again, I can shoot on that platform, and that flies through and splatters all of that. Nice. We'll just make sure it's really, really splattered over that way. There we go. Make a mess. Make a mess. So now I can probably do the same running thing that I did last time. So momentum. <laughs> Then shoot portal there, then fall back through the hole, then get over here, and then we've still got speed. Yes, we got across. So we made it to the exit. Oh, that was a decent puzzle there. So we are out of here into there, although I've just noticed I don't have to go into the elevator. There's a little bit of a little bit of a sneaky secret area here. Oh, hello. Look, we can go through this vent. Oh, what is this? What is this? It's a white room. This is a chair I can't pick up. Oh my goodness. Oh, I can shoot portals, eh? Don't know if that helps. What is this room? Very strange. Don't know. All right, perhaps that was like a little Easter egg or something. Let me know in the comments if you know what, what that was all about. But we're on to the next oh, level. Looks like you're about to get an upgrade to your portal device. Ooh. About time. Do I get to shoot orange portals? No, oh, look, there it is. Yes, it's shooting orange portals. Oh, it's going mental. It looks like a laughing velociraptor. Oh, no, hang on. It's a blue, it's a bird. There's a bird pecking it. What are you doing? You're not, Stop pecking it. All right, anyway, if I shoot through this portal, I should be looking through there. Yeah, then I can jump through and get the button, which turns on a laser above my head. That's not going to kill the bird, is it? Okay, laser goes to there. The glass saved the bird. Yeah, I guess I need to work out where do I want a laser. Oh, look, there's a cube down there. Can I go in that water or is it poo water? It looks kind of pooey. Let me just see. Oh, I can. I can walk in the water. It's safe. It's safe. All right. So, cube. Oh, look. I think the laser has to end up shooting that thing. So, we need we need a portal there. If I just get back here with the cube, I can make sure the laser is always on. So, then I can shoot there so the laser comes through. Oh, oh. It's an elevator. Right. Let me, let me stand on this first, please, game. So, 
portal there to turn that on, to turn lift on. Oh, and then do I just jump over? Get off my portal, you stupid bird. Portal upgrade. It looks like a downgrade. Tell you what, though, bit of portal lore. The portal gun's made out of hex guns, which are the best of guns. All right, so now I can... Oh, I can shoot both portals again. It's been a while. Right, so shoot a, shoot a portal there. Then I've just got to get some height and drop down are oh, presumably over that way so if i have a portal up there portal down there i can get the speed thing is how am i meant to shoot this oh no no i've got it i've got it so if i i'm i'm up here now by the way so my my orange is there so if i just shoot a blue through there i should just go wee up to, up to the exit what's going on there I can't see you from here. Oh, no. What's happened? I'm stuck in a lift. I'm hearing some unfavorable noises. Are you okay down there? I'm not sure. I'm in a lift. Oh, dear. All right, get the hell off that. Try to find a test chamber. I can't see you there. Okay, we've got to find a test chamber so our little robot man can help us. Um, by the way, that reminds me of a story time with Matt. So when I was like, I think 17, I wasn't quite, I wasn't quite 18. But uh, I went to Lanzarote, or Lanzarote, as they call it, uh, with my mate. And um, we'd had, there's like a free bar. Obviously, we're a bit young to be drinking, but whatever. But uh, when we were heading back, we were heading back with like some, some friends that we'd made. And uh, it was like two or three three in the morning or something and I was like a lift and we got in this lift and being like the immature children we were uh, we started like shaking the lift and then it just stopped and we were like oh god because like the hoot like everyone was asleep um so yeah we were stuck in this stuck in this lift we pressed the alarm thing a few times no one came as I said 3 a.m whatever it was everyone's asleep so we were like oh balls what do we do now thankfully my engineering brain decided let's try and force the doors open uh, and they did they did force open and we were probably like three inches like below the floor so literally barely even a step up to like get out the lift I was scared of like a Resident Evil happening though being chopped in half but um yeah we made it out the lift so I lived to tell the tale story time with Matt all right so trying to work out what I'm trying to do here I think I gotta fly up to the air and then I can probably like shoot straight ahead somehow. So if I just head like back over that way using this portal, then you can see my portal's up over there. So if I now drop down and do that one, oh god. Okay, I'm now flying. <laughs> I'm flying up and down. So yeah, I want to end up 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 there with my blue portal. So, oh, it wasn't blue. It was orange. <laughs> okay, so so orange portal down there. And then as I fly up that orange portal on the floor over that way. Okay, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Orange portal. Boosh. Yes. Then we're up there. Oh no, we're still falling through. Hang on. Let me let me get off the orange portal. Ah, I can't get off it. Ah, stop pushing me in. Someone keeps pushing me in. All right. Anyway, we made it up here. Um. Oh, there's nothing up here. What am I? What am I meant to do up here, game? Oh, I did just shoot a portal up there. Okay, so I can get through this fence. So then I'm round here, and then we've got vents beneath me. We got. A staircase over this way let's go up the staircase all right so we've got we got something on the wonk there so we're gonna want to fly through that somehow that looks like i need a lot of momentum though okay so if i just have a look around what was back in this portal i'm <laughs> I can't remember what we're looking at. Is that the floor? Yes, yeah, so that's the floor. Okay, okay, okay. We're back here. That's good. So if I just do orange portal down here as I jump, I can then fly across and we just about made it. Oh my goodness, my legs. Right, so we made the jump. We're now over this side, presumably drop down here. We are very much not in a test chamber. Right, we'll head over this way. Oh, look, we are back in the test chamber. There's a button down there. Can't see anything up here that I need. Okay, so we'll drop down. If I now press this button, oh, is that a cube? So I think I've just dropped a cube down there. Let's wang a portal there just so I can get back up. We'll try and see what we actually did down there. So maybe a portal down that way and drop down. So, oh, look, cubes. Loads of cubes. So I just take one, I guess, and put it back on that button. So button is there. Boosh. Then yeah, nice. We've got we've got the exit. I don't know what all these cubes are for. Though. I might just sacrifice these cubes, like to the cube god. The elevator will get us back on track. Oh, I wouldn't let me. All right, anyway, we've been told we are getting closer to the surface, but it's still... We're taking the scenic route. Uh, oh, we're on to chapter four, though. The diversion, hence scenic route. Oh, wow, this game just got a bit dark, I think. Uh, and anyway, I think that's probably a place to leave it because I'm terrified now. So, peace, love, and portals. Bye, guys.